teleschool.com learn tele for free hi guys rishit cha from teleschool.com once again today we are going to learn how to pass entries for debit notes and credit notes respectively now let's first get into the concept of debit note and credit note for example when you buy something from a shop and if you don't like it you return the goods and the shopkeeper or the owner of the shop gives you a credit that's actually a credit note if you see on the top of the document that is that he gives to you a certain credit note that means he is giving credit to buy again from the good from the shop without paying anything up to the extent up to the amount that is written on the credit note and similarly the exact opposite of this is a debit note so he gives you credit note for you it is a credit note and for him it is a debit note so let's directly jump into it i have already passed the entries for sales and purchases let me show you it into the profit and loss account by simply pressing p okay so here it is i have made a sales entry for 15000 rupees and purchase entry for 10000 rupees so my net profit is 5000 okay so i have made sales to cheng worth 15000 rupees and i have made i have purchased from amit for 10000 rupees so suppose let's say cheng came to me to return the goods worth 5000 rupees so as i have made sales to cheng i will be passing a credit note entry for passing credit note entry you have to go into the accounting vouchers by simply pressing v from the great from the gateway of tally so press p now by default it's a journal or by default it can be payment so let's select credit note this time i'll be clicking okay uh, here it is or you can press control f8 okay so credit note you can see on the top left corner so we'll credit chang as we have debited him as he's our debtor because we have sold goods to him so we'll credit chang for 5000 and debit sales return because he's returning now sales return account has to be made under the sales accounts only let me show it to you here it is sales account sales return account and it is under sales accounts so no okay pass it okay so we have passed the credit note entry for sales return this is actually a case of sales return when we are passing a credit note entry now suppose we have purchased from amit as i've said earlier worth 10000 rupees of goods and we don't like the goods worth 3000 and we are returning to him so in, it is exact opposite of what cheng returned to us that is it is the exact opposite of credit note which is the debit note so for that the shortcut is control f9 let's press it so yeah i am in the debit note now and we'll pass it now as we have purchased from it it will be standing on our credit side that is liability side so we will debit him for 3000 rupees and we will credit purchase return okay so here it is debit amit and credit purchase return okay so we have passed both credit notes and debit notes by now you will have easily understood the concept of debit note and credit note why they are passed and how they can be passed in tally it's it is pretty simple once again when we purchase from someone and we don't like it we return the goods to them we get a credit note and that credit note for us is a credit note but for for him who is issuing the credit note is a debit note because we have purchased from it it can be i have explained it by 
two simple different transactions for simplicity for example uh, for in the previous entry when we return the goods which we have purchased to amit because we have purchased will passing will be passing a debit note entry and for him because he has sold he'll be passing a credit note entry okay let's see the effect in the profit and loss account here it is see purchase we have returned the goods worth 3000 to amit so it is minus balance showing is the minus balance is showing and sales had been returned so sales will also reduce so it is showing minus 5000 from 15000 so in total after recording purchase and sales returns both we have sold goods worth 10000 and purchased worth 7000 and the not net profit is not the not profit but net profit is 3000 rupees so it is pretty simple it is not as complicated as it looks the basic concept is when we purchase the goods and we don't like it we return it we pass the debit note entry when we say sold the goods and someone returns back to us we pass a credit note entry so guys thank you for watching this video i hope you like it and if you liked it very much follow tele school on facebook follow it on google plus follow youtube please subscribe to youtube by pressing the red button subscribe tele school so you'll get every update of a video directly to your inbox thank you very much have a good day bye bye please like us on facebook that is facebook.com slash tally school you can also subscribe the tally school's youtube channel that is youtube.com slash tally school and you can also give a plus a positive sign of truth or a positive sign of words to us that is tally school google.com slash plus tally school now if you are more serious and if you want every tip trick technique in tally some of which are not shared ever on the blog and will be shared directly in the newsletter here is it you can join tally schools you newsletter it's free to join simply go to the website tallyschool.com and join the newsletter okay and lastly don't forget to hit the big subscribe button down there on the youtube for video updates directly to your inbox hit the big subscribe button now